If you're anything like me, you love a good deal. And with Black Friday here, what I thought I'd do is share with you my opinions and recommendations on some of the best photo editing software out there that is currently significantly discounted from what it normally is. I'll give you my recommendation for photo editors, programs for managing and organizing your photos, tools for improving the quality of our photos, such as denoise, sharpening, upscaling, and also plugins and options for just generally enhancing the overall look of our photos. So hopefully you guys can get the best deal this Black Friday. And if you'd like to know how I spent $6,000 in the name of photography this Black Friday, stick around to the end and I'll share with you where that money's gone. Don't tell my wife. Okay, let's kick things off with the king of the crop when it comes to creative photo editing, and that is Adobe. If you want to get the absolute most out of your photo editing, you simply cannot look past the Photoshop and Lightroom combo. And if you've previously wanted to give it a try, but been put off by the price, as you can see, they are currently running a 50% Black Friday deal. But the only downside with Adobe and their software is you don't own it. It's a subscription model, so it's a recurring payment. So that is something to bear in mind, and I know that isn't everyone's preference, but I do have some other options for photo editors and photo organization tools that are just buy once, own it outright. Personally, I use Adobe Lightroom to organize my vast catalogs of photos and have done for many years. Weddings, landscapes, architectural work, it's all managed through Lightroom. However, other options are available and I'm going to show you a really good one now, Xire. So if your photo editor lacks decent library and cataloging functions, then Xire Photo 2024 is a perfect solution for you. They are currently running a 25% discount and the tools that this software has are incredible. So for example, this feature here, unrestricted free text search. Well, what is that? Basically, you can describe your photo. So for example, a picture of the Eiffel Tower on a sunny day and the AI will go into your catalog and find and retrieve that photo for you. So that is an incredibly powerful feature as is search for similar photos. We've also got a search for faces and people, and I love this tool. The AI that drives this is so much better than what's inside Lightroom. We've also got automatic tagging, so you can add keywords to your photos, but the cool thing is you're not having to do it. It's automatic. It will assign keywords directly to your photos, so you can find them so much easier. You've got GPS search, aesthetic assessments, which is a really cool feature. The AI is going to go in, look at all your photos, analyze them, and assign them a score between zero and 100 as to how good it thinks they are. And then you can actually sort your photos in ascending or descending order by that value, which has the potential to save you so much time going through your photos and assigning a star rating based on what you think. You can leverage the AI so that you can always find your favorite photos so much quicker. So if you think Xire looks like a good fit for your photo organization, absolutely check out their deal at the moment. It's 25% off. This is New Zealand dollars that you see right here. Usually it's around 225 US dollars, 250 US dollars, and I think it's about 175 at the moment. So it's currently a really great time to get hold of that. This software and any other that I mentioned, I'm gonna put links to it in the description below. And if I can get a better price or a discount code, I'll also put that as well. And don't worry if you're watching this after the Black Friday sales have finished, because I'm gonna reach out to these companies and see if I can't get you guys a decent discount as well and if I can I'll add that to the link in the description below. In terms of photo management and organization it's all there inside that app. It's so much more powerful than Lightroom and if I hadn't been using Lightroom for years and be well invested in that system then I would certainly be looking and considering this as my alternative. So if you're a Luminar user I would certainly recommend complementing that if uh, you have a large database or library of photos that you need to organize this is an excellent tool for doing that. But it's not the only option, so let me bring your attention to another piece of software from one of the most trusted names in the photographic industry, DxO. They've got a fantastic organizational tool and photo editor built into one, a bit like Lightroom. Let me show you. DxO actually produces some of my favorite software. This one here, Nick Collection, we are gonna come back to. However, what I wanna show you right now is Photo Lab 7. As you can see, it's only $169 at the moment, usually 229. And because Photo Lab is now in its seventh edition, I feel like DxO have really fine-tuned this, so it's a beautiful piece of software. It is so nice to use. 
It's designed as a high-end raw editing software and it absolutely does not disappoint. It is just so, so powerful. Now these key points that they've got written down here, unparalleled image quality, groundbreaking deep prime denoise technology, legendary optical correction. It just sounds so over the top or just marketing hyperbole. However, I have to say that their deep prime technology for cleaning up noisy photos, it far supersedes anything out there. It's better than Lightroom's AI, it's better than Luminart, that's not hard for that, um, but it's the best out there. It's also better than Topaz Denoise for raw files as well, exceptional. Their lens correction technology, uh, having access to that, that is the industry standard. They thoroughly and robustly test all cameras with all lenses and they have profiles to match everything and correct for all of that. Like I say, industry leading professional results. It truly is one of the best. So for $169 at the moment to have access to that, if you're a someone who photographs raw photos and you want to edit those, you cannot look past this. It is absolutely fantastic. I still usually use Lightroom, but that's because I've been using it for years and it's just like my go-to. But if I wasn't and I needed to edit my raw photos, DxO Photo Lab 7 would 100% be the way I'd go. If you're looking for an excellent photo editor and a system that manages your photos all in one that you buy once, you're not subscribing to, an excellent option that I know a lot of you guys really like as well is On One Photo Raw. Now on the version 2024, they're currently running a promo on that for Black Friday as well. So let me show you that one. As you can see, we've got options to just try it now for free or get the Black Friday deal which currently has 25% off. And as you can see, it has a satisfaction guarantee of 30 days if you're not happy. And the price you see here, this is in New Zealand dollars, so it's not that much in US dollars, so don't worry. So as On One says, it's your all-in-one solution for stunning photos. They've got some really great tools. So Brilliance AI is one of them, and basically it's analyzing your whole photo and making adjustments. If you're familiar with Luminar Neo, it's very similar to their Accent AI, and it works for all different types of photos. So here's a landscape and as you can see it's making adjustments all through the photo and it does it locally as well. Fantastic. It's got exceptional AI masking that does a really good job of identifying areas and then you can make specific adjustments to those areas. And as you can see from these convenient little icons here, you can do organizational tasks, you basic develop, but you've also got AI masking, sky swap, portrait enhancements, no noise, resizing, HDR, all of that included for a one-off price. So you purchase it and you own all of this stuff. So in terms of value for money, On One Photo Raw is exceptional. You're getting that photo editor, organizational capability, and you're getting so many features built into the software that with other platforms, you have to either subscribe to get access to that or purchase those extensions additionally. If you want an alternative to say Luminar Neo, you're fed up with playing a subscription or buying extensions, on One Photo Raw just packages it all into one thing, and again, it's a one-time purchase. Currently at 25% off, well worth checking out. I'll put a link to it in the description below. Now, while we're mentioning Luminar Neo, if you're someone who has that lifetime license and you don't have access to the new generative AI tools or the extensions, and that's something that you do want to get access to, now is a great time to do it because it is significantly discounted. You can also use the discount code that I have in the description below to get a further saving. So well worth checking out if you're a Luminar Neo user. Now, before we move on from software that can both manage our photos and edit them as well, I do have to mention ACDC, which is becoming a serious player in this market. They have the ACDC Photo Studio, and in terms of value, it's by far the top of the list. It's very, very good, but it's also affordable as well. And they're currently running discounts all the way up to 63% off of that software. So let me show you that. They have various options through the store, but there's a couple that I would seriously recommend looking at, and that is the first one, the ultimate pack that is discounted from 209 US dollars down to 119. Exceptional value in that pack, they're actually including their five pieces of software. So you get the photo studio, you also get gemstone, which is an editor. And another great thing is they're also offering a free trial as well. So you might as well check it out, see if you like it. And if you do, take advantage of the deal. Okay, let's talk about software options for improving our photo quality. And I'm talking about digital noise, sharpness, and upscaling. It kind of all falls under one umbrella. And I'm really no stranger to this because I get bombarded by companies asking me to trial and test their software. So I can say without a doubt which one is the best. 
and that is Topaz. Photo AI 2.0 combines their best technology, Sharpen AI, Denoise AI, and the mighty, mighty Gigapixel. I love that so much. That's now all seamlessly integrated into one application, and we can currently get it at a massive discount. Let me show you. Topaz Labs very rarely run sales, so it's a fantastic time to take advantage of this. Normally 199, but you can see we've got up to 60% off on Black Friday. And those of you who normally follow my channel will have seen me use Sharpen AI to improve results. Gigapixel, that's a phenomenal tool for improving image quality, and also Denoise AI. However, what we can do is actually combine all of that technology into one app. Photo AI. As the quote from Tech Radar says, mind blown, it's like getting a sharper lens and better camera. It really is. So let's have a quick look at these before and afters. Honestly, these are the kind of results that you can expect. Look at how low resolution this is and how much detail is being revealed as we go back and forth. I still remember the first time I saw examples like this of Topaz and I thought, yeah, right, it's not really gonna be that good, is it? But honestly, the way it cleans photos up, it really is this good, it's phenomenal. So like if you're a wedding photographer, perfect. Wildlife photographer, perfect. Look at the detail around the eyes, absolutely insane. And they've also really improved the algorithms for dealing with people. So you can see just how well it's cleaning up the detail on this dancer here as well. So if you've got soft or noisy or low resolution photos, Topaz AI can fix all of that for you. Really fantastic software and some of the best money I've ever spent in improving my photos. And talking improving photos, we're gonna go back to DxO because they've got some fantastic tools that are integral to my workflow professionally, personally, basically the creme de la creme of creative photo editing. I love these applications. They work as standalone or plugin. So regardless of your photo editing setup, you can use them. Let me show you. So DxO are running a massive 50% Black Friday discount, and as you can see, the clock is ticking. The software they create is extremely high caliber. We've already looked at Photo Lab 7, exceptional. Nick Collection 6 we're gonna get to, but there's a couple of other things I'd like to show you just to start with. Film Pack 7 allows us to emulate traditional films from back in the day, and it does it so convincingly. Viewpoint 4 is the most advanced geometric correction program out there, so if you do a lot of architectural work, like I do, this tool is absolutely invaluable for sorting out and correcting your geometry. If you don't do architectural photography, you don't really have a need for a tool as specific as this, but if you do, it's a brilliant addition to your software suite. But let me tell you about an absolute game-changing bit of software, which is Pure Raw, now on version 3.7. This is amazing for improving your raw files. It gets so much positive feedback from both amateur and professional photographers, but I think this one sums it up. It's like looking at a photo and then cleaning your glasses and looking again. It really is game-changing. You're gonna get denoise, you're gonna get sharpening, and it's all done on your raw photos, preserving the output as a raw file so you have a better place to start your edit from. If you want to improve your raw files at their very core, this is a software for you. Noise reduction equivalent to over ISO 2.5 stops, and I would actually argue that I've had results that exceed that claim there. I think I've pushed things to like three and a half, four stops improvements before. You're gonna get extra image sharpness and detail even from older cameras, and you also get access to those industry-leading DxO optics modules, which are industry leading they are the best of the best so if improving raw photos is what you're after and particularly if you're a professional this really is a bit of software that cannot be overlooked so this stuff is built into the photo lab 7 that i shared with you earlier but if let's say you're a lightroom user but you still want to benefit from deep prime technology all of this amazing technology for cleaning up and improving your raw photos you can get this and it works seamlessly as a plugin for lightroom it also works as a standalone app as well so I would strongly recommend, check it out because it's normally $129, currently $89, great value at the moment. Now onto one of my favorite plugins of all time that I've been using for so many years, and that is the Knit Collection. Color Effects is my absolute favorite plugin or standalone app of all time. I love it so much. I can't stress just how useful this plugin. It's got so many great features built into it for improving your photo. It's also got Nick Silver Effects Pro, which in itself is just a fantastic piece of software. It's for black and white conversion, and in my opinion, and many people around the world, the best black and white conversion software in the world. So color effects and silver effects, those two alone are worth the entry fee, you know? 
absolutely amazing software but also analog effects if you're someone who likes that more retro kind of look to your photos then this software is just absolutely brilliant for creating that more vintage style look I mean, this is how good I think Color Effects Pro is. If you only got that in the Nick collection and nothing else, I still would buy it for that $149, not discounted. I like, I would invest in it every time because I always use it for my architectural work. I've used it for years for my fine art work, my wedding photography work, my landscapes. Everything goes through Color Effects Pro before it is finally saved. And on top of Color Effects, you also get seven other amazing plugins for image improvement as well. Strongly recommend you check it out. There's also a free trial there as well. I appreciate I've thrown a lot of information at you in this video, but I just wanted to get out to you all those best deals so you don't miss out on Black Friday. However, if you want me to cover any of this software in more detail, please let me know in the description. And if enough of you request it, I'll put something together for you. So if you've been wondering how I managed to spend $6,000 this Black Friday, well, it's not a new lens, it's not a new camera, it's actually an upgrade to my computer system. I've had this one for five years now and I've constructed uh, from various components what I hope to be a graphics and video processing beast. And if you'd like to know how I built that, my thought process in choosing the components, why I've gone for PC versus Mac, just let me know in the comments below and I'll cover that in a future video. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you get yourselves a really good Black Friday deal this Black Friday and I will see you in the next video. Why don't you check out that one right there and if you haven't subscribed already, you can always do that by clicking the big AT right there. Cheers, bye bye.